Okay. So, as far as I know, all right. So this this is essentially what happened. So, someone made a video over Tectone, and it was really fucking stupid. Like it was it was really bad. It was really really bad. And so now they're they, Tectone invited him to a to a little one on one chat. And then, this is, where apparently it blows up even further. So, we'll see. And if you haven't already seen the original video, uh, I already did a reaction to that one. But yeah, all it. To to recap, basically, this. This dude was making some really stupid arguments and just I don't know. It was it was really bad. It was it was rough. Like I honestly I can't even explain it. Like you just need to watch it. But anyways, okay. Okay, uh, we're calling uh, we're calling flip guys. Uh, quadratic in the semi quadratic homophobic scaling with the white fat dude stuff. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, who the fuck thinks about advanced mass while applying the crap with quadratics guys you can do whatever you want to do okay that's all that matters uh the review bomb stuff yeah we, we can talk about whatever y'all want to talk about guys i just when somebody wants to talk i, I like to give them the the opportunity to talk about whatever they want to talk about. It just needs to ignore some relevant people. Oh, yeah, yes. <laughs> okay, so... So, th this reminds me of whenever, uh... Whenever th there was that whole uh, Tony Two Ghost drama. Like, Tony Two Ghost, his video was kind of just like, uh, like, it, it, was, it, it wasn't too bad. Like, it was just like, whatever. But... The fact that like such giant fucking creators started just shitting on this guy, I felt really fucking bad for Tony Two Ghost. I mean, he, sh I get he was just trying to defend Tower Fantasy, but it, it was it was just a dumb video. But like, I don't know, I, I felt bad because like they just started fucking shitting on him. But but the guy who made the video for Tech Tone, that video was just like it was just horrible. Horrible overall, like just the worst content I've ever seen. Hello. Some of oh, the now worst. Just to, just to make sure for video proof, you consented to talking, right? Yes. I didn't I didn't bully you into talking? <laughs> you did not. Okay, I just want to make sure. I'm I'm, I instigated it yesterday as well. Yeah, I wanted to make sure Actually, that uh, be able to this see isn't the another Jin Jinx and Tuner situation where I get uh, called a harasser and a bullier for talking to somebody uh, on the internet. Uh, <laughs> cool. So, a uh, one year ago, I'm gonna give chat some backstory about this conversation. All one right. year ago, guys, uh, Flip makes these videos on the internet uh, called the Genshin Court. Yep. <laughs> let me sh let me show you all these things. Uh, in case you guys don't know, uh, I am I am Flip's most popular video, which I'm very proud of. <laughs> uh, maybe viewer count scales with how much of a clown people think you are on the internet. I don't know. Me personally, I think that the MTash video should have gotten more than me, but that's neither here nor there. Psycho Poco, too. Was that a good one? Which one Which one is your best Genshin Court flip? My best one? It, I think yeah. it's my second Vars one, actually. The most recent one I did. Who, on who? On Vars, if you know who he is. No, who's that? He makes, like, Genshin videos on why, why no one plays specific units, basically. Oh, okay. Like who? Like, he made it, I think his most recent one was, like, why no one plays Zhao. But, but like, I thought... he just basically, like... But I yeah, thought I, Zi I thought Zyox made Zhao. Or plays Zhao. Let's yeah, Zyox go, Eggie Love. Plays Zhao a lot. Oh, by the way, when are you making the, uh, the Zyox Genshin Court? Did someone ask that in your chat? No, why? I'm just wondering. Okay, uh, it's, it's not possible. He... He's he's good. So, wait, you're saying Zyox is too good to make a Genshin court on? It's not that okay. It, he just has no takes. He's like just purely information, so it's hard to make one on him. And why do you think that is? I mean, cause like, 
Why do you think? Why do you think a content creator would make no takes? <laughs> I, I I can give a few reasons as to why. Because if you yeah. say someone's favorite character is bad or something, mm -hmm. then that, that just basically makes you a target for the whole fan base. Oh, okay. Which is basically what happens to <laughs> Oh, okay. Like, since he makes videos on like no one plays specific units. Okay. What about a what about a Genshin court on like Tawano or like Enviosity? They're too casual. <laughs> Envy's too casual? Yes. The bro collects mint for 12 what? hours a day. Uh, am I supposed to talk about how he collects mint and how you're supposed to optimize that? I can't. Well, I mean, maybe his maybe his mint farming route is uh, unoptimal. Who knows? I, I should look into it, actually. Thank you for the idea. Yeah, no, I got you, bro. So uh, out of all the content creators you talk about here, which one uh, do you fucking hate the most? <laughs> okay, I don't... Okay. Just to clear things up, I don't hate any of the content creators that make Genshin Quartz on. I, I don't. But you like you the... like you like Amtash? <laughs> yes? That's crazy, bro. This changes everything. This changes everything. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> okay. So what was on what was your inspiration for making the Genshin Quartz? I was streaming and then one of my friends was in my chat and he said Okay, because my first one was on Sekapoko. So yeah. he sent me a clip of Sekapoko saying Kaya is better than Ganyu and Aika, unless you see 6 or 5 Ganyu and, I Ganyu and Aika. And then I heard that, I was like, wait, what? Yeah. I was like, this can't be like a real take, right? And then he sends me more of Sekapoka's videos. Mm -hmm. And how like a lot of the he is better, Sekapoka's isn't he? videos are wild, if, to say the least. And then from that, I just made my first one. And, yeah. Yeah, I've, I've never watched a single Sekapoka video, so I have no idea. I've seen him stream on Twitch from time to time. Yeah. Uh, that's about it. Uh, so how do you feel about the Ganyu is worse than Kaya take? Oh, he said that? Yeah, I just, yeah. Wait, was that, Kaya... was that, was it a joke or no? No, it was like, he was being serious. <laughs> he said Kaya is better than Ganyu and Aika unless you see six or five of them. I get it, man. He, like... he must know yeah. something that I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that is... Wait, that, that can't was be exact. real. I mean, Wait, he's, that can't be he's real. more fun and to he play. he down on it. No. Hold on, let me find the clip. Okay. All right. All right. That's sick. Uh, so I wanted to, to let you know. So one of the things yeah. I wanted to talk to you about was uh, I made a quote uh, about two years ago. It was kind of an offhanded quote. It wasn't anything too serious. I think I said... Um, Ayato, Ayaka, Kazuha, oh my and God. Bennett. No, no, no. It was Ayato, Ayaka, Raiden, Shogun, and Bennett. Bennett, yes. uh, How does that make a bad team? Uh, yeah. So one of your community members, they said this, not me. Uh, they made a video on it. Did you see it? Oh, I saw the video, yeah. And you commented on it? Yeah, dude. Uh, so they I was really confused. Them. And I'm hoping you can break this down for me. So yeah. I said, how can that be a bad team? So they actually go into the spiral. But their name is... Uh, Curran the anime. In case you guys don't know, guys, I type tech tone yeah. and then I search by upload date every day because I'm an egomaniac and I need to know what people are saying about me. Uh, and so. this this chick went into the spiral abyss uh, with the team, the Raiden Shogun, Ayato, Ayaka, Bennett. And during this entire video, they're acting like they're struggling by by using the team, but but they clear every stage with like. <laughs> Tons of time left over, like 30 seconds left over. Uh, well, I think there was like a minute left over. On the final boss, they fucking tear it to shreds. Uh, yeah, they, they beat the final boss with a minute and 10 seconds left, and they do it on mobile. Now, the other thing about this is, when I said that, this was before Dendro. Before any of that. So I am wondering. It, yeah, this was before. Because I, I said this, what, back in like 2021? Uh, same thing. Same uh, thing with like games. electro being the worst element. That was back in 2021. Uh, yeah. So I am wondering, how is that a bad team if they're beating it on mobile with a minute and ten seconds left? The hardest <laughs> content in the game. I mean, I think one of the most like obvious things is that they they have a C3. They're, okay, this person is a dolphin, right? Yeah. They have a C3 ride in, and uh -huh. then both then their Ica and Ito they both have like, the five star weapon as well. Uh -huh. And then someone else did it, I think, actually. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Oh, no, his video got deleted, but, um... Because, like, I feel like there's a big difference 
and I think a lot of theory crafters may take this a little bit too to heart, where when sure, somebody yeah. says uh, something is viable or good, that doesn't mean that it's optimal. And I think sometimes when I say things like, oh, how is this team not good? I'm not saying it's, how is this team not the best team in history? This beats every other team in the entire game. I'm just saying, like, how the fuck can you fuck up if you're using, like, Bennett and three five stars? Yeah, it's a, the problem is that the three five stars don't really, like, synergize together. The yeah, they do. The important here talking. How did they synergize together, though? Oh, because it looks cool. <laughs> Right, bro. Facts. And that's, it does and that's, look cool. I agree. Genshin's yeah, a very pretty game, but like, how do the characters synergize together? Why do they need to when the content's for babies? I mean, one of the things you said a lot in the video was that like, because mm. I talked about Zhongli and basically not needing a healer for some teams, and then you try to like substantiate that like you need a healer, you need a shielder. Yeah, you and do. If you do need a healer and you need a shielder, then, okay, then how is the game easy in that case? Well, because it's easy when you just pick a healer, right? Yeah. Baby game. So then you just pick well, a healer well, and the game's easy. Like, why would you not do that? Okay. So, the per... You, um... <laughs> I don't know what the person's name was, but you gave a like, like, max account. Like, <laughs> the pauses are just getting me. But... I mean, I... Like, I, I, I usually don't say this, but... You know, some would say that, like, my teams are not the, the most fully functional. And I still take a steaming dump on the Abyss. <laughs> right? Yeah, cool. extra, extra, Emily? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, you were still, like, they were struggling uh, very much with, like, two of the most broken C6 characters. Yep. With the game's easy. Oh, yeah, no, I agree. I mean, if you give a completely new player the game and tell them, hey, beat the game when they don't even know how to use the controls... Yeah, they're probably going to struggle. Them. Huh? You're teaching them, though. No, I just said, hey, use Nuvulet and Kazuha. They're good. Right, because, um... You even, no, you even watch Soul's video on it, because there was this one that was, like, so ridiculously difficult that even Dolphins were struggling to clear it. And, like, that was one point where, like, hyper-optimization actually mattered. Okay, and, like, when we talk about meta, right? Uh -huh. I'm not saying everyone play international play Hyper Bloom. Because uh. you can take very, like, not good units, and if you know how to, like, build them and make a team for them, you can even take someone like Chi Chi, and she has, like, she has the clam set, right? Yeah, no, yeah, and clam then, set, yeah. yeah so <laughs> not even paying team, attention. If you <laughs> probe superconduct on someone, you reduce, like, physical resistance of them. So if you get Chi Chi, you on-field her, then you get, like, three other strong off-field yep. characters. You can just make like a really strong Chi Chi team like that. Oh, no. Riku, you know about Chi Chi, right? And then that's how you can clear with Chi Chi, even though like Chi Chi's not one of the best characters. Is this is this true? Right, is but he isn't, lying? That, isn't that like entirely proving my point that you don't need to play often, you can just beat it with whoever? I mean, but there's a difference between like taking a Chi Chi team and like having a meaning behind the Chi Chi team and then taking Bennett and three random five stars that don't work together. Right, but like I don't think you need units to like actually work together to beat the content. Chi Chi is the best character. Like you can just beat it with you can just beat it with like whoever. I mean, like, cause the thing is with extra Emily, I gave her a new account, and then if you go to her VOD within one hour, she beats the hardest content in the game without having any previous practice, without knowing quadratic scaling, without understanding the Pythagorean okay. theorem, right? Without <laughs> without even knowing ninth grade algebra, she still beat the hardest content in the game. Okay, but there. You, okay, like if you do look at some of your viewers and you look at like, especially when you were playing the game, the people you were account reviewing, they didn't clear the abyss, right? Yeah, then I went on their account. And no, I beat it for them. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't matter if you beat it for them. They didn't understand like how to clear the game, right? What back back two years ago? It was only like a year ago. Oh like, no, my last account review. Hold on, let me pull that up. It's been all right, a long time, man. Hold up, let's go. I've been I've been clean at Genshin for a long time, like a long time. Oh, this I also is quit, like during the desert. It was you horrible. you quit? Yeah, the desert was horrible. <laughs> dude, I came back for Fontaine. Dude, I was not a fan of Sumeru at all. That shit made me lose my fucking bad. mind. I agree. <laughs> hold up, let's go. Did you play Honkai Star Rail? Desert. I no. <laughs> oh, okay, hold on. Let me scroll here. Uh, Jesus, when the fuck was my last account review? Five hundred dollars for Yalon. Uh, to be fair, you post like daily as well, so it's gonna be way harder to find. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
My dad found my YouTube channel. <laughs> Bro, that thumbnail is crazy. Um, yeah, maybe like a maybe like a year, two months, maybe that that sounds about right. Yeah. What what was the what was the point you were getting out here? I was saying that those people who they watch you all the time as well, so they don't mm -hmm. have to like beat the game, right? So how is it so easy that you don't need to like know how synergies work or anything? Wait, are you saying that Genshin Impact is a hard game? I don't think. Uh, okay. What do you define as hard? Uh, requiring great skill to beat. Okay, I don't think Genshin requires great skill, but at least knowledge is something that I think is a requirement. I sure had only. I think the, the, like, the low investment. I think the. Do you think that knowing quadratic formula is a, is important to beat the game? I mean, because not every character has quadratic scaling. But like for someone like Ganyu, knowing that okay, if you pair Ganyu with Venti, like the more enemies that are in a tightly confined space, that'll increase your damage by a lot. Knowing that for like a newer player is gonna like help them a lot. Yeah, but who would have known? Like, but like, how would you not know my AOE abilities do more damage if I use them in AOE? Like, who's because not gonna not, know that? Because not all AOE abilities do more damage when you're in AOE. Like, when Wait, how would, how, would a more, how would an AOE damage ability do less damage single target? Or how would it do more damage single target? I mean, like, Deluke's normal attack is AOE, can hit like three enemies, but like, they're spaced. Like, you have. Do I need to explain quadratic scaling to you? <laughs> I mean, will that help me beat the Spiral Abyss? It depends on... Because only some units have quadratic scaling. If it applies to the unit, then it's going to help you. <laughs> sure, you can you can explain it if you like. Okay, because with Deluke, if you stand in a group with Deluke, he's still doing like 10,000 to each enemy individually. He's... Yeah. And then if you get Gonyu... You... Like... As, as much as Tectone likes to say... He doesn't like drama, and he likes to stay out of drama. He fucking loves it. He fucking loves it. I love drama, too. It's hilarious to watch. But he fucking loves it. I don't believe him for a second. That That is the only reason why he's talking to this guy. You. The news are burst. The more enemies there are... It's because he knows that, that not only is this drama, but he's going to make this person look really fucking more stupid. More are going to hit more of the enemies, because the, the icicles are an AOE splash. Not, not that debating over Genshin isn't stupid in and of itself. Right. But, like, yeah, that so comes the boys on my original point, like, who wouldn't know if I hit the same ability on more enemies, it's going to do more damage? Like, how would somebody not know that? Like, instead of using my attack on one character, I use that same attack on three characters. Like, who would ever think, that's probably going to do less damage. Like, who wouldn't know that? I mean, it didn't really help any, did it? Because Kaza's swirls are half quadratic. Emmy didn't even know how to press the button. She didn't even know Q and E were like the, the buttons to press. And then in one hour, she beat Floor 9. Yeah, but Floor 9's not really the hard content in the game. What is? Okay, because... Okay, there's hard in, like, Dark Souls hard, and then there's hard for Genshin standards. Uh -huh. Which I think for a lot... I want to like, give my... Of this was Emily didn't even know how to dodge. Fair enough, but, like, I'm trying to say... Uh -huh. That for a lot of because people who play Spiral of Abyss is a min minority, right? No one plays it. Agree to that? I think it's cleared by the minority because nobody wants to do it. Because it gives why people think... anxiety. Facts. Do you really? <laughs> okay, why does it give people anxiety? Well, that's what the devs themselves said. Sure. Okay, but why do you think it gives them anxiety? Uh, probably it's because if it's, so, if it's such a steamroll, like you can just do uh -huh. it with like any character. I think it's because nobody wants to fuck around and spend time beating content on a game for three fucking gems uh, twice a month when they have bills to pay and they have their family to be with and their job is miserable enough without having to do uh, content in the game that some people deem unenjoyable because all people want to do is collect seashells and watch Farina make funny noises. I, I love watching Farina make funny noises. Why do you, why do you think... Mm -hmm. um, Okay, but if it's such a okay, no, you said to yourself it's a steamroll if you just have characters that yeah, just any character with that gets buffed with the healer. Yeah, if you build if you build two teams, it should be pretty fucking easy. Then, but everyone can build two teams. So but why they isn't won't. Everyone clear. But, <laughs> but they're not going to. They're gonna play like, the game. They're gonna do the story. They're not gonna build up their characters, and they're just gonna play the story. This is a story casual game to collect and explore. But. 
and I can prove that to you. If the majority of players were playing this game for the combat, Genshin Impact would have died years ago. This is a casual game by casual players. Nobody's going to play hardcore. Less than 5 to 8% of players are actually going to build their characters, and they're just going to play for the story, and the company themselves has confirmed that. What do you think is the most one of the most popular types of Genshin content on YouTube right now? Story. What else? Guides. Okay, why do you think guides are a popular thing? Why do I think guides are a popular thing? Or do you think that YouTube analytics directly uh, correlate with player base and what the players want? I mean, if something's getting viewed like a ton more than other types of content, like why isn't fishing content popular, teapot content? So like people because players, want to watch guides. Do you think because that all, do you think every Genshin Effect player watches Genshin YouTube? I mean, no. Mm -hmm. It's probably less than 5% of the player base. That's just, that's really just a baseless claim that you. Mm. If you're saying my claim's baseless, then so is yours. Because you were also saying okay. that the majority of people watching YouTube content are watching it for guides. Yeah, yeah, because if you look, if you search up Genshin Impact, the most, some of the most popular content is guides. Some of, sure. And that's like. So's, so's guide content of. on everything. Do you think guide tutorial videos are watched more than like movies but, like Insidious? No, no, no. But why do you think guides specifically for Genshin are popular? Well, they're guides. Guides are popular for everything. Guides are popular for Animal Crossing. Okay, why would you need... Okay, if it was easy, why would you need a guide, though? If it was easy, why would you need a guide? Yeah, okay, so why... Do, so, like, every time a new character comes out, like, 20,000 different YouTubers are posting a day one Genshin guide on mm -hmm. them, and those all get hundreds to thousands of views if i type in do you think putting your shoes on is hard because there's a song called put on your shoes with 806 million views it's a song <laughs> also yes, the fastest way to put on your shoes with five Riku, that that is the exact explanation people don't want to have to actually play the game and they just like ev everyone just wants to see a guide and then be done, right? Like it, it, yeah. Five million views. The fast, okay, yeah, but that's specific. The fastest way to put on your shoes. What's something that you think is really easy to do? Is that walking. All right. Breathing. All right. How to walk. Five hundred thousand views. How to walk properly. A hundred thousand views. <laughs> Wait, wait, okay, no, how to walk properly, that links, to, okay, I actually know about this, that links to posture and, like, trying to... Look at this, 2.5 million views, how to walk. But if it's so easy, why would 2.5 million people walk? Okay, actually, uh, so this, I'm gonna have to actually give this one to, uh, to Flip. Uh, so, you, you, like, it's, it's actually surprising, okay, as a personal trainer... It is surprising how the most the most insignificant things such as walking or squatting down or sitting mainly has to do with posture. No one fucking knows how to do. So people don't want to walk. <laughs> well, it's because you know everyone has bad fucking posture. Like obviously, you know, and and there actually is. Uh, I forgot what the term is called, but. Uh, uh, you can actually tell by someone's walk, like, what, what possible issues that they have with posture. So, walk, like, putting one foot in front of the other, that's easy, but there actually is a correct way to walk. So, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to give this one to Flip. To be fair, like, Sorry, tech so, that, No, how to walk is so... No, if I saw a video in my recommended mm -hmm. saying how to walk, I would 100% click on that. Mm -hmm. Just to see what they say. Okay. That's not even just because walking is... Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you think anyone in that comment section is going to be like, wow, I didn't know how to walk? Maybe. When you look in the like comments of a Genshin guy, it's like, okay, thank you Not for right. telling me how to build this character. Do you know what... Do you know what the most viewed video is for Genshin Impact content? For, instead of guides, it's Emergency Food Paimon by Blop with 5.1 million views. Isn't that a song? No, it's Blop. 
giggling at Paimon saying, I, uh, emergency food? Don't call me that. This has, this has 5 million views. Dear Lord. Right. Is that not insane? That is insane. Hold on, there has to be a more popular Genshin video than that. Alright. How did you find that? Yeah, the story, like, it's the story trailers that were released ages ago. And then... Yeah, the story trailers. I'm gonna fast forward this a little I said bit. That a lot of times. Okay, a majority of players. Mm -hmm. Okay, because again, you, we've established that a majority of players have not cleared the abyss. Okay. And they well, do whether that's due to inability or lack of interest is yet to be determined, right? Sure. But why would they not be interested? Because the rewards are shit. I mean, I, I feel like six hundred primos every two weeks is pretty good. Yeah, six hundred like primos every. Well, so. 600 primos is different from a full clear 36 star. Uh, yeah. Let's see here. So 600 primo gems every two like weeks. So you yeah, make 1,200. Yeah, and I haven't touched a card game either. Yeah, I don't care how much primos they offer for the card game. I'm never fucking touching it. And then you divide that by 1,200. So it's going to take you 240 weeks of clearing, or 240 clears of the Spiral Abyss to guarantee you a five-star character. So 240 months. Okay. Uh, what was, what's the point? Well, I'm the saying like that's that's why like the rewards are like they're like not good. Yeah, a lot of rewards in Genshin. Most rewards in Genshin are bad actually. Like the only yeah. thing we're chasing is primal gems. No, I think the only thing the players are chasing is just doing the story and like collecting seashells. Character collecting. Like, why like would I want to, why would I want to, like, build all my characters, log in every day, learn college-grade pre-calculus, you know? <laughs> okay, no, you don't, you don't even, okay, you don't this even need to understand quadratic skills, just know this. the simple fact that it's That's like, actually it's true. <laughs> okay. But going, okay, like, going back to the point, actually, yeah, a lot of rewards mm. in Genshin are horrible. Mm. And a lot, a lot of people do things in Genshin for the reward, which is just essentially a primo gem. Like yeah, like they like collect the chest, or they do the story, and then they get the rewards, or they do the events, because then they can go play uh, the tower defense game. You know, they can sit there and they can uh, watch the meta churls walk past the towers, and then they'll die, and then at the end of the event, they collect three thousand gems. Yeah, to be fair, it's not three thousand. That's a, that's an exaggeration. Oh, well, how much is it? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, well, then it might be three thousand. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's actually three thousand. Am I nuts? I think I think events. In general, cap out like 2,400 if it's a... Uh, hey, 2,400, that's pretty good. Wait, no, wait, hold on. Hey. Like, event, wait, no, 60 times... Maybe I'm getting Genshin events confused with Honkai Star Rail events. It's been a long time. So, okay, yeah, yeah. So, it, like, the weekly, like, random weekly events where you do it for a week and then they die is 360. Uh-huh. And then... No, it's 420. And then... Other ones... Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Isn't that sad? Let me ask you a question. Why did you quit Genshin Impact? Why did I quit? I, I walked into the desert. Yep. The desert sucked, and then I just stopped playing. And I wasn't interested in any of the Sumeru characters. Because when right. you play Genshin, you're basically just chasing characters, and I didn't like any the of The desert characters. actually kind of sucked. So you didn't want to do the Spiral Abyss? Oh, no, actually it was cool for a, for a total of... Of ten so seconds. You didn't, so you didn't. Quit. And then, and then, and then you realize that you have to fucking run everywhere. I mean, do you think? And it's just emptiness. To like actively playing the game. Yep, to casual players. Yep. <sighs> yep. Do so you think casual players log in once every two weeks? Yeah, that sounds about right. They log in when they want to play. You know. Yeah, but what? Like, I, I feel like people have a lot more free time than that. Do you work a job? No, I, I, I am a full-time student. If you worked a job, you'd probably get that player, or people don't have that much free time. Fair enough. You know, like, uh, just for example, I, I run two companies, and I have a whole, like, talent agency, and I also do YouTube and Twitch, right? I also manage a couple other people, and uh, I think I have about two hours of free time a day when I'm, like, actually grinding hard. But, uh, you know, during my free time, like, if I was just, like, you know, going to school, you know, and, you know, to be fair, 
You know, a lot of kids who just go to school and then when they get home, they have like eight hours of free time a day. But I think for a lot of like hardworking individuals, I don't think they just want to like make sure Publix. they check their Genshin dailies. They're probably What's just that? trying to make sure they have enough money to pay rent. Who do you think is There's the majority of the players that plays Genshin? Children. Yeah, right? And who do you think so, they're so, making content for? And scaling children, the difficulty right? to? Children. Yeah, okay. So what 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 about what I said confused you? I'm I'm seeing where where like, it goes wrong. They're, all, they're like putting in like these sternest hours into the game. Well, don't you like kind of have to? Not really though. <laughs> it's like we do we do this mostly the same things that you guys do. We just log in for like thirty minutes to our commissions, then log off. If you think casual players do their commissions i think that's a warped reality i think they just log in walk around say oh gone you so pretty and then they log off i mean I, like they I, jerk I, off I to gone you and, and, and then they log off satisfied with that, but... uh -huh. okay I'm and, I, like... and i don't think there's anything wrong with somebody being like oh i like the story and then like for example the majority of players i know from my thing. community i can't say for all players the majority of my friends are just like I logged in to do the story quest for 4.0, and then they're gonna log in for 4.1 to do the story quest, and then they're gonna not log in until 4.2 to do the story quest. Log in, fat yeah, load, and log. Like that well. Yeah, that's what I. I think. know. Okay. okay, so do you think casual players? Mm -hmm. Wait. No, okay. Okay. No, because you're. On like very opposite ends of the spectrum, right? Uh, no, I don't so have autism. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry, go ahead. God damn. Okay. Okay. Anyways, mm -hmm. <laughs> back on the point. Mm -hmm. okay. so you have not players doing like hard labor in Genshin, then you have casual players who log in once every six weeks. Yep. Okay, so there there is a middle ground, right? Sure, there there might be half casual, half meta hybrid. I I, I think I'm a hybrid. But, but I'm trying to say because you're at very two very extreme. Oops. Okay, no, because that doesn't even make sense. Okay, because you say you can make guides for casual. Dude, players. this can be settled so easily. I th I think the whole point is that Tectone isn't super knowledgeable at, about the game. Which I don't think anyone goes to Tectone thinking, wow, let me figure out what his deep, intricate knowledge of Genshin is. It's like, no, they just want to see his C6, R5 characters take a dump on everything. But I don't think that was ever in dispute. And so that's why this whole conversation is like fucking stupid. <laughs> so so it, it keeps being redirected to, but is the game hard? Well, No. And it's like, ah. Yep. The casual players, they'll look in once every six weeks. Yeah, the ones where they're like, they don't care about having 100% crit rate and 300% crit damage. Like, I made a build, I made a build for Bennett um, where it's just it put a whole yes. bunch of HP on him. Like, and it works, right? Because when you stand in the ultimate, you're just, I mean, you're not going to die. And at the end of the day, like, if you don't die, you're most likely going to beat the content. So that's one of my guides I'm very proud of. It's called the, uh, let me pull it up for you real quick. Bennett Tectone. I, I watched you when, I, when you made that. You, I remember you hiding your Bennett build for a very long time. Yep. Time. The OP yeah. Bennett build. All HP. Because a lot of people, uh, you know, they wanted to go it like, you know, some crit rate and some pyro damage. But for me, it's just, you know, put a whole bunch of HP percent on them and uh, bada bing, bada boom. There you go. You know what's very funny about that? Hmm. A lot of theory crafters would actually recommend you just do that and focus on building up your other characters. Yeah, I mean, I think I think it was a pretty good guide. You know, a lot of I think a, for, for the meta for Benna, I think a lot of people, uh, you know, changed their old tune when Tectone descended upon Earth and released the greatest guide in history. Okay, but do you not see that as a contradiction? In what way? Because your build requires you to get four no bless and three HP main stats. Sure. And then you said a casual player logs in once every six weeks to play the story, then they never touch the game until the next story quest comes out. Yep. So why would they build that build on Bennett and not build build like 
the really pretty characters and just do the story with the really pretty characters. Oh, like, because only the Bennett. people who are looking for a Bennett guide would have clicked my video. But you said, in okay, when you were responding to my Genshin court, you said you make guides for casual players. Yep. <laughs> the, the casual players that look in once every six weeks. No, anybody who's on YouTube. I think that if you are actively looking for a guide, I mean, you're probably a little bit more than the regular casual. So you don't make guides for casual players. How do you figure that? Like it's just a it's just a for fun guy. What do you I'm, what do you what do you not what do you not get in here? <laughs> no, you, you, know, you, you you defined clearly what, what you think a meta player is and what you think a casual player is. You said a casual player doesn't care about builds. Genshin's never on the forefront of their minds, and mm -hmm. they just do the story and look out. So that means that that casual player would never ever click on your Bennett guide because it wouldn't be applicable to them. So you're now saying there is a middle ground and there mm, are players that I don't are think that still. I don't think saying I'm making a burger for vegetarians doesn't mean that a carnivore wouldn't eat it. And what that means is, even though I made a guide for casual players, that doesn't mean that everybody who clicks the video is going to be a casual player. People who aren't the target demographic can click videos that aren't specifically designated to them. And thinking that videos will only go to your target demographic. Does it get any juicier? They're doing commissions. Because if you don't interact with the majority of the game, then what, like, it's hard to call that person a player. Okay, so like, on like, so if somebody only played Genshin Impact for the story, you would say they don't play Genshin Impact? I'd say they just... Essentially, their experience could quite literally be subbed out by watching a warp video. And that's not a player? I mean, they're a player, but they're just purely a story player. My brain hurts so because these... The game, then? These are just stupid, like... <laughs> Everything about it is just so fucking stupid. Like... On both ends, I mean, like, it's, I, hardcore players are playing the shit Genshin added to keep people every week, not players who play to enjoy. Just give him a thousand bucks, stop this. Dude, everyone is just like, this is fucking stupid. Yes, that is, that is exactly right. The guy is like, or like this, this dude that he, or flip is just fucking stupid takes Genshin way too seriously and Tectone is being petty as fuck 100% yeah, they still play the game but they're not even playing casually at that point they're playing once every six weeks that's not casually what is it? I think casually you have to interact with other systems like the all Tectone is doing right now is trying to just constantly embarrass this dude it's 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 so they're they're still arguing over the exact same thing. Overworld, like, well, they have to walk around that to do the just making content exactly. Which is why, like I said, teleport everywhere basically. You just go from location A to location B. He he okay. he loves doing the drama stuff. Well, I think a casual about player drama. is someone who only plays the things for what they like to do, and then they log off. When yes, done. milking they it. Don't feel a, obligated to play the game like a slutty cow. So, that, so that's a different definition, right? Yeah, I would agree. There's a different definition than yours. Yep. Than the, the, the definition you gave before. Which is what? You said a casual player is someone who plays once every six weeks to do the arc. Yeah, the whenever game. they play for when they want to play and they don't feel obligated to play. That's the same definition. Because it's it, it's literally just, you know, Flip saying, "But is it the most optimal?" And then Tectone is just constantly replying with, "But does it have to be?" And that's 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 it. They want to play once every six weeks. They want to play once every three days. You know, it's just whenever they enjoy the game. Okay, it's so the same. It's the same okay, definition. I can write it out for you if you like. Oh okay, my okay, dear. Let's just, okay, let's just assume it's the same definition. Then. We don't have to assume here. I'll write it out. All right. So I said, a casual <laughs> yeah. player is someone who only plays. This is petty. This is actually really petty. When they want to, not have to. And then I also said a casual player could be someone who only plays when they want to.
to do the story once every six weeks. How are these not? How are these not this the, is the content you like? Casual player is someone who does whatever they want. So. Yep. Okay, me playing Matt is me doing whatever I want, <laughs> and that's why I have fun doing. Sure. So would you consider yourself I'm, a casual I'm, player? No, but by your definition, I'm a casual player, right? Because I'm just doing whatever I want. Yeah. There you go. If you if you can actually look me in the eye and say every single time you play Genshin Impact, you're so excited to play. You're so excited to grind. You're like thinking, oh my god, collecting 90 seashells. Holy shit. I'm so excited. Wait, no, do you think anyone enjoys doing that though? And that's my point. Those who don't want to do it won't do it. Okay, so so no no no. Okay, let's keep that definition then. So if I'm building up my character, I play casually. I I do whatever I want. If I'm building up my character, and then I'm forced to collect 128 seashells to mm. to build my character. You're not yeah, forced. Do. You can do it if you like. Yeah, but I, I like Raiden, and I, I think she's really pretty. So I want to build her up. No. Well, if you don't ascend your world level, you won't have to. You can I mean, still do the story. Are... A lot of things are locked out if you don't. I think. You think or do you know? I mean, I don't know, but at the same time, I feel like... Do you think it's a good idea to bring in points that you don't know into an argument? It might make you look a little bit silly. I mean, you also... What? You don't want to look silly now, do you? A lot of Genshin fans are watching. Sure, but you also, like, brought in many points that you didn't know. That's because I'm okay with being silly. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> That's the whole point. <laughs> I'm, I'm okay with being a little bit silly. What a silly, silly okay, little guy. You want to be a little piece. silly head? Okay. Right. I'm so, just a silly little think, guy. Like, how many systems in Genshin do you think are, like, not fun? Uh, what are systems? Like artifacts and like oh grinding. Gosh. How long does this fucking go? Who don't want his elemental infusion. Control. I think it prevents Bennett from being able to be played with whoever players want, rather than, oh man, some pyro damage buff. Very cool. Uh, I think it's very bad because I can't use my Bennett with my Eula, who's one of my favorite characters. Razor. Uh, he even fucks with Ayaka and Kazuha. Uh, and it's really frustrating. And I don't like having my Bennett not being able to be used with those teams, or at least making the teams sick. See, if everyone would just not fucking play Bennett like me, play, uh, this, this wouldn't I even be a debate. I think that that's good versus just staying at C5. Okay, what's your favorite part about Eula? Oh what do you think? Her ass, dude. Her, oh, also, she, looking at, looking her, at her ass. ass and also, her ass. That's yeah, right. yeah, yeah, okay. Yes. Okay. That is the, the only reason to to, to, to play Eula. Okay, I do agree with you there. I think it should be, Constellation should be toggleable. Yeah, go on. Clearly. Okay. And I feel like C5 Bennett can be used with everyone. Are they still C6 Bennett going? cannot be used with everyone. How long do they go? Which which video is this? I need to find it. I'll okay. send you the link on the Discord. Okay. Because I'm curious how, when somebody comes to me for my opinion, Right, if they the wanted a they fact, a skirt. they would probably Google GenshinImpactGuide.com. Okay, no, but I'm assuming if they want the... my opinion, they would come to me for my opinion. Otherwise, they probably would have gone to, you know, a more objective site. Wait, did you change your playlists? Uh, my YouTube is not run by me. Oh. Okay, hold on. I need to find it myself. <laughs> Alright. Almost every oh, time I've bad. heard you talk about C6 Bennett being bad, you've said why. Well, the re the reality is, chat, the majority of times... Oh, hey, Pink. Ooh, thank you for the food. Oh, I appreciate the fuck out of that. Yeah, I mean, a lot of the issues that he I've pays had her to with, wear like, that. the Genshin Impact community, guys, I is because, too. you know, I stream a long time. You know, I usually stream like 8 to 10 hours every day. I, I don't think anybody should be expected to speak eloquently for 8 to 10 hours a day, as well as out-of-context clips. I mean, let's be real, man. I mean, people thought that I was racist because I said Yunjin's singing was bad. Wouldn't everybody know it's 30 minutes later when we heard her other song? It was really I said it was bad. quite good. But the reality is, is when people see... Uh, how long do they go? I have to not, not find the video. It's okay. it's the exact same. Because what I don't. 
fast Reverse forward again. Oh, it, Reverse oh, melt. Melt. Okay. <sighs> vaporize. Reverse vaporize. Yep. Reverse vaporize. Which one of these? Which one of these is Electro worse than? Melt and forward melt. So reverse melt and melt. And do you think wait, Electro? Wait, wait, do you think on. uh? Do you think wait, that wait, hold Taser? On, wait, okay. wait, hold on. Re re rephrase that. Wait. What did you say? Did you say what is it better than or what is it worse? Than? No. Which which one of Electro do you think it's worse than? Because we're gonna do which one's worse and then which one do you think is better? Miskiff, uh, have ibuprofen and take some Pepto Bismol. Wait, do you think so? Which electro reaction do I think is the best? Yeah, so I was saying that electro was bad, right? Yes. And so I'm curious, which one do you? Because I'm sure you don't think electro was the best. So which I one do you think of best. these reactions? Do you think electro was better than or worse than? I think electro very clearly better than melt and reverse melt. And then, wait, forward vaporized too. You think like, you think electro was better than all of those? Everything except reverse vaporize, because that's like jangling Hu Tao stuff. Okay, sorry. Um, but you 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 actually think that Electro was like better than vaporize? It was better than forward vaporize, yes. Because forward vaporize is a reaction you can't really build a team around. What does that mean? Are, are we talking about the archetype of team or the specific reaction? Wait. So I said Electro was bad because it was the weakest element. Yeah. Which it was. Because Geo got was buffed due to Zhongli. Geo, Geo's always been the weakest element. No, it got buffed due to Zhongli and gave, you know, yeah. Res Shred, which was great. Yeah, Electro also had its reaction buffed. Uh-huh. But it was the weakest two elements when the game first came out were Geo and Electro. Before Dendro. This is objective fact. I mean, and then Geo got different. buffed. So if Geo got buffed, where would that yeah, leave Electro? I mean, this is your ter interpretation of that. I would just disagree with it. Disagree with what logistics? Or facts? I disagree. That's why you stopped playing Razor. Because you put reactions and then told me to rank Electro in those reactions. I mean, okay. let's let's take. If he's talking about like Raiden Shogun specifically, then it's like, okay, she was really she was Electro and she was she's fucking insane. Take away this. Let's take away this list. So, yeah. Electro, right? Yeah. What were the best elements back in let's say what? Two point oh. Two point oh. Two point oh. That wonderful actually then because um. He had Freeze. Freeze was very broken. Because he had uh -huh. Ganyu and Aika Freeze teams. Then okay. there's where all the characters are good. Sucros, Kazaha. Mm -hmm. Then Hydro's broken. Yep. Three. And then that's where I'd put Electro after that. What would you put under it? I'd put Pyro, Geo, and... Am I missing an element? Pyro, Geo? Did, yeah, I'm missing an element. Oh, Dendro wasn't out then. Yeah, Dendro wasn't out. Yeah, so just Pyro and Geo then. You would say Pyro was worse than Electro? Yes. Okay, who are the who were the strong Pyro characters back then? Zhangling, Bennett, Vital. They have. And so you think yeah, Zhangling I... was weak back then? I don't see no, I don't think Zhangling was weak. Zhangling was a very strong character. You think Hu Tao was weak back then? I don't think Hu Tao was weak either. But like, well, so the, who were the weak ones? Please? I mean, yeah. Please kind of. She's okay. But then if you look at, okay, no, if you look at the Electro characters, you have Fischl, uh -huh. Beto, Raiden was there at the time. Beto, okay. You don't think Beto's strong? No, I'm just saying Beto, okay. I'm just agreeing with you, West. Okay. Yeah, so Fischl, one of the strongest off-field damage leaders in the game. Yeah, how's Beto? Beto. Okay, but, okay, how's... How was two point? Yeah, but she's got giant uh, mommy milkers. Okay, you, can't, so. you can't even. You have Jin Yang in your element. Mm -hmm. But I'm not right, talking so. about the carrots. I'm talking about like, the reactions. 
Can we okay, then you have electric charge. It's one of the most broken reactions in the game. Was it? Yeah, okay, because um, if you apply electric and hydro to enemy, then you have two auras on the enemy. Uh -huh. So that means you can add, if you add pyro to that, you overload and you would vaporize the exact same hit. And if you had, if you had onomo to it, then you would swirl both of those elements so at the same time. So you say that electro charge was good, so old taser. Old taser, sure, yeah. So what did that reaction do? I mean, it's not, I mean, the reaction itself allows you to apply two elements to an enemy and swirl both of them. Right, and then how much and damage would that do? Double swirls, a lot of damage. Okay, would it do more than vaporize or reverse melt? Okay, so you think if if I can hit... I think that if there's it. other reactions that are better, then the other one would be worse. So Okay, so why is forward melt better than, like, ele electro charge team? What, what forward melt teams are there? All right, let me Google it. Forward melt Genshin Impact. The only team you're going to get... I, I will tell you, where you're going to get melt Luke. That's it. Hold up. Forward melt. There's one post on forward melt from nine months ago with one upvote. <laughs> can you can you okay, link me you to like? Electro, wanna search up electro charge teams or how good how flexible electro charge teams are? Guys, can somebody tell me what the fuck forward melt is? It's when you apply cryo onto an enemy and then <sighs> apply pyro afterwards for two times multiplayer. Uh, uh, uh. Can you get you can at Zajef in here? Guys, I would rather rip off my fucking ball sack than talk to that guy. Uh, <laughs> Is it what's up? Yeah. No, nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. Uh, so, you want me to look up forward melt? Is that in the game? Like, is that a thing that, that yes, it's Genshin you, says? And it says, and in the game, it says forward melt? I mean, you wrote it down. It says there's reverse melt and there's forward melt. Okay, and then how does reverse melt work? Uh, that's when you're using. That's when you apply pyro with jangling, and then you get like Rosaria or Kaya to. Melt okay, it. all right. And then how much damage or, or does that one. allow you to do more? I mean, it's a 1.5 times multiplier. Oh gosh, dude. Fast forward again. Numbers and say this is the bigger numbers. That I don't think it's ever. disingenuous. I was just linked this by a mod, and I was just showing you objectively. I mean, you're the meta player here. I'm just a casual. <laughs> okay. Cut, right, like yeah. you're like the be all end all of guides. I would say that's more Zyx or Zyjeth, but sure. Oh, are you like their fans or what? I mean, I don't, I don't really watch... I think Zyox, I think Zyox is great. Yeah, cool, but besides, like, people telling me to what to what Because people <clears throat> request Genshin courts. I actually don't watch Genshin YouTube that much. Oh, so then you just, like, just pull shit out of your ass without researching it? I mean, I, I, mean, I look into the creators after they tell me to look into them. By like what finding like one out of context clips from like two years of information and saying wow this guy is a fucking idiot. No, no, actually, I actually had I actually had a rule that I'd only do things within the past three months. Okay. But yeah, back on the point of reactions. So what are you trying to say, son? Like I'm saying, Geo got a buff. Electro yeah. needed a buff, and Electro got that buff in the form of Dendro. I don't think Electro really needed a buff. Well, I if it was wasn't as good as the other reactions, then it probably needed a buff. Okay, then why did Zhongli get a buff? Why did Zhongli get a buff? Because yeah. China was angry. China was very angry at Dea. Dea didn't get a buff. At Dea? Well, yeah, that's because they realized after the Zhongli incident, they don't need to listen to their players anymore because people are still going to spend on their game. China number yeah, one. So... <laughs> I'm confused now. I can tell flip. So, so so getting a buff doesn't necessarily mean the thing was weak in the first place. So you think Zhongli was good before the buff? No, Zhongli was horrible. Zhongli is still like arguably mediocre. <sighs> okay. So I think anybody would know if they played back in like before 2.0 and maybe even 2.0 that Electro was the weakest element. I would say that's pretty much agreed upon. I disagree with that notion, though. Why is Electro a weak element compared to other elements? Uh, because the other elements would do more, and they had better characters, barring Raid and Shogun would... in the form of Zhang Ling. Or, the... you know, Xing Cho. I mean, because then you have a character like Fischl. Fischl's one of the strongest characters in the game. Now. Look at... Now, yeah. Before, she was also one... She was one of, if not the biggest... Like, 
biggest think, in the game. You think she's the best character in the game, Fischl? I didn't say she's the best character in the game. I said she's one of the best characters. So who like would you the, put above her? Above Fischl? Yeah. Like, generally speaking, Jing Cho... Bennett, Did you not verbatim Bennett. say she was the strongest character? Because, like, don't be wrong. Yeah. I used Fish a lot at the start. I thought she was yeah. great. I think Fish was the strongest character in the game now, but I wouldn't say she was the strongest character in the game back then. Right. I would also say that. Because I would argue okay. that Electro was much weaker back then than it is now. No, but even even back then, Fisher was still consistently one of the stronger units. I know, I made a video on it. I called it Banjo-Kazooie yeah, so, Comp. I summoned Fisher okay, so, and I summoned Zhang Ling. Right, okay, so Fisher is a very strong character. Raiden's a very strong character. Beta's a very strong character. That's three very strong characters. Can you list three characters in each other element that are just as strong? Uh, let's pull it up. All right, sure. All right, uh, Genshin Impact tier list 2.0? 2.6. Because that was the time your video was released when Aya came out. All right. So we have a list here. Here's the Genshin Impact 2.0 all character tier list. Unless you think there was like a significant change that happened from 2.0 to 2.6. You got you brought up, you brought up a Genshin up tier list. What's wrong? Oh, are these guys not good enough? I I thought you were just gonna get like your own tier list and then rank them. Oh no, is this, is Genshin Lab are they not good enough? I mean, I made it. I actually made a video on Genshin websites and they're one of the Genshin websites that you Genshin courted Genshin Lab. Yes, I did. <laughs> okay, hold on. Do you want to see something funny? Open. I, so where where do you think this tier list is wrong? A lot of things. <laughs> Okay. I wouldn't put. Do you want me to just say like the obvious? Yeah, you you talk to chat. Okay. Okay. Sure. I'll take over. Oh, did you actually just leave? <laughs> All right. Bro. Um, dude. SS okay. Posted, I wouldn't put Venti there. Holy shit, dude! If anyone ever walks away like that, like if if Flip still had a shred of dignity, he'd literally be like. Go fuck yourself and then just leave the call. But obviously, he's still gonna. T God damn it, dude. Tectone is literally spitting on this dude, and this dude is opening up his mouth and swallowing it. I wouldn't put Zhongli there. I wouldn't put Gani there. I wouldn't put Tartaglia there. I wouldn't put Hu Tao there. I wouldn't put Zhao there. This is, this is bad. There. Jean is way too high. Oh my god. Why is Clue so high? Mona, definitely not. Albedo, fuck no. Yula is way too high. Yoimiya is S tier? Actually, Young Fei, she actually needs to be in SSS. So this tier list is actually dead wrong. So, why is Sucro so low? Kiching in, a, huh? in the same tier? Dude, this is so bad. As Sucro's, that is a crime. What do you mean? Everyone knows that Yan Fei is the only uh, uh, six-star character in the game. Oh, he's back. And anyone who argues is just wrong. Uh, uh, Chi Chi, Chi Chi's way too high too. Chi Chi? Why is she? She's an A tier with Fischl and Beto. Mm. What Barbara A? This is the tier list you wanted to get. This is the most viewed tier list when I type this in. I'm not it's saying not I stand by it. I'm just saying I just I literally Googled Genshin Impact tier list 2.0. This is the one that the internet recommends me. Yeah, but I asked for I asked for your opinion. All right. My, my opinion on what? Like okay, I said you have Fischl, you have Beto, and you have Raiden. Can you name uh, me three other characters in each element that are as good as them? Alright. Fischl, Raiden, and Beto? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Venti. Zhongli. Ganyu. By, by, by each element. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just going down the list. Venti. Oh, okay. Zhongli. Ganyu. Bennett. I'd argue Ganyu is Hu not. Tao. Xing Chou. Kazuha. Hu Tao is not. You don't think Hu Tao's good? Back in 2.0, you I don't think, think Hu Tao was good. No, Hu, Tao, 
No, Hu Tao was great, but like there was a lot more AoE checks back then, so Hu Tao kind of suffered. Wait, where's Raiden? You You don't think no. Hu Tao was insane when she came out? No, Hu Tao no Hu Tao was insane. I'm saying this is two point oh. Hu Tao was the meta. Oh, this is 2.0. I mean, okay. yeah, she's a meta character, but there's a lot of things that are meta. I thought he said it was going to be 2.6. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I, was, I was about to I'm say, like, wait. I was insane back then, but I'm saying the other characters are just as good. If not better, at the time. Beto was better than Hu Tao? You can make the argument. So, I can't make... <laughs> you, you, he can make the argument. He, he 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 apparently has an argument to prove that. Make that argument because I have a fucking brain. I could what? <laughs> <laughs> so no, I wouldn't make that fucking okay. argument. Okay, wait, wait, so so wait, 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 so you are the. But this sounds mean if I say I don't want to say because it it's gonna sound mean. <laughs> That's okay. I mean, your channel's kind of dedicated to shitting on other content creators. You yeah, can but pretty much. When, but when I, yeah, but when I do that, it's like I'm playing up so much, but I'm like actually talking to you. Know, so I feel bad. I mean, let's be real. I mean, the comments that are going on your channel, you can't really like feign. Oh my god. You can't really. I mean, you can't feign accountability. Like the accounts you let on your or the, the comments you let on your videos are pretty insane. I'm actually, do I just delete them then? That's what I do. If anybody shit talks any of my friends in my comments or my uh, chat, I get that shit moderated as okay, much as friends, I can. You, you're not my friend. Oh, I know. I'm I'm very aware. If, no, I like you, dude. But I'm saying, but you said you would do it for your friends and for your, like your chat. Uh -huh. Like, if you go to your recent video, do you know how many people are shitting on me? Did you delete those comments? Oh. No, I did that because I don't like you, right? Because you made this video on me that like kind of caused me a lot of issues for no don't reason. I caused you a lot of issues. Yeah. I mean, I apologize if I did. That wasn't my intention. Dude, flip. Was You're such a pussy, dude. My intention is to say, do you think I hate you? I don't want to make this uh Oh, my God. Are you beautiful? Bro. Uh, <laughs> no, but I'm just trying to say. I, oh, my God, dude. No, because. No, okay. I make my videos basically. Did my mic just cut out? No, you're good. But yeah, what, what, do you, what do you think making the video the king of misconceptions called crime scene do not cross, putting a clown nose on my face, or yeah, the clown yeah, of the Genshin Impact community, wait, 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 wait. Do you not, Do you not see how much of an exaggeration that is? Uh-huh. It's like, it's, I'm, the, the, like, the joke in the video is that I'm taking it so seriously when it's just a Genshin take, it's not that deep. Oh, so these, these are just jokes. Okay, no, 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 I'm saying the actual, when I'm actually criticizing your takes and talking about them, mm -hmm. that is like, serious, I'm trying to make like a serious criticism. Bro. I play it up so much, like the point of absolute, I say in the video, you, for the offenses you made to the meta and theory crafting community. Dude, it's, it's, an, it's annoying how, how like, I guess just like, wussified flip sounds right now, like, he could easily go in so hard on tech tone, like, I, Gosh, but I, I don't. I, 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 I don't guess know. The delivery was a cuck. He, pr probably, probably. But I, I don't know if if he's like afraid of Tectone's chat or something. But like, bro, like he could easily say so much shit back. But like, he's he's. I, I guess he's just nervous or scared or what? Man. I don't know. Okay, I agree, because I don't even like my old Genshin chords. Right. But, like, if you look at my more recent... Mm. If you Because I... I just but, basically but you, started but this, But this video is just a joke? I mean, when I call you, like, a, when I have you in... If, if it's just a joke, scene, then we're chilling. Are we chilling? <laughs> yeah, no, if, if this video was just a joke... Know. I mean, like, again, I'm trying to say, like, I'm trying to actually pick apart your takes, but uh -huh. I'm doing it to, like, such an absurd degree. And I think that is supposed to be fun. Like, a lot of people think that's funny. Yeah, I know, man. I want to see like, what I, the... Want... It's hard to keep up with the chat. <laughs> I don't get this. My, the point of my videos is just to basically say, do your own research at the end of the day. Because Tectone's not a reliable source of information. Here, wait, let me pause. I just want to go... 
Was trying to dance around the point. Such a nice joke. I was like, Yeah, the the like this this conversation really is getting fucking awkward. Reliable source of information. Do you think Sekapoko For... is? Do you think you are? Uh, some of my takes are shit. <laughs> okay. Because uh, um because um the, Jason, I remember Jason watched one of my videos. He thought I made mm -hmm. some bad takes in there. That's fair. It's like. The Genshin meta is an objective. A lot of people disagree mm -hmm. with each other, even in theory crafting communities. So when you watched my video and it was so funny that you were crying, what was the uh, what was the funny part? The funny part is when you called me a virgin, and then when you called me fat and ugly. Oh, have you had you sex before? No, I'm a virgin. I'm eight. <laughs> <laughs> I was seventeen when I made the video, dude. Okay. So Wait. Like, this. I mean, it's okay. I mean, I mean, you're young. This is an 18 year old. Bro. Okay. I. I hold on. I need to get another drink before I start this. Oh my god. Bro. Dude, okay, that's actually fucked up. That's, like, Virginia, he, he, he probably is, but, like, dude, he's 18. God damn. Like, I thought this dude was, like, like, you know, 21 or up at least. Dude, okay, this is just fucked up on Tectone's part at this point. Yeah, that makes sense. I, I can see how you wouldn't understand how this these type of videos are like defamatory. Now I'm not saying there's anything wrong with those. I make those videos Defam bro, you're you're literally a multi millionaire talking shit to an eighteen year old who made a stupid fucking video. Like, okay, I I don't know. Fuck, dude. I'm 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 I flipped. I flipped. I'm back on flip side. Holy shit. God damn it. It was all the time too. But at least you have to own, you have to own the fact that that content is incredibly toxic. You can't just say, oh, it's just jokes. It's like, I mean, for example, I shit on people. I know I'm an asshole. I get that I'm a fucked up dude. I get wait, that you, shit, wait. right? You want to know what my channel bio was before I changed it to the Fury Nigga guy? Mm. I mean, just, 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 bro, just, like, just, here's a quick my, example. My Twitter bio was called, I'm a professional. Holy shit. shit. I, I... Wait. Bro. Like. Bro, he's literally a fucking child. Oh my gosh. It's a... Yes, like, this is literally... He needs to man up. Yeah, he definitely needs to man up, but, but like, I understand why he's so fucking terrified right now. Okay, but, but, but here's my point. This is an 18-year-old being, like, put on the spot in front of, like, at least... He usually gets what, like, okay, Tectone is just chatting right now. He, okay, he has 2.4 thousand. Usually he has, like, between, you know, three to five, but I get why he's so fucking, like, terrified right now. Obviously, he does need to man up. He needs to fucking stand his ground and take a steaming dump and fight back against Tectone right now, but he's obviously kind of a pussy. But it doesn't change the fact that Tectone is just, I don't know. It, it gets to a point to where it's just like, all right, dude, like you've, you've more than proved your point and you, you, you got more than you needed. And it's just, this is just sad at this point. I don't know. I'm aware. I believe it. But like, you gotta understand, like I have an emote called dick tone. You, you can't yeah. just say that the oh, videos are just oh, jokes. Wait, 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 I'm trying to say, no, they aren't, mm. I'm trying to, it's such a, uh, hold on. Go ahead. Let me show you something. Bro. On my most recent video. So I... A multi-millionaire. God. 
like it's defamatory. It's like, god damn, dude. I don't. I, don't I posted know. this on my Discord today. Uh huh. I'm trying to get a screenshot. It it it, it looks like he, he's struggling. Community shits on me as much as I show on other creators. If not, like, it doesn't matter. And why do you think that is? So the 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 reason why is because it's like he he's saying that it's it's caused him so much issues but has it or is it just someone talking shit like like it's like if that guy made a video on if he made a video on me like like i, I would i would definitely have more fun with it but like it again that like this whole conversation should have ended 30 minutes ago like, it should have lasted 10 minutes and then been done, right? Because Tectone would have proved his point, showed that this dude's a fucking idiot, kind of a pussy. But at this point, it's just, it's getting too, like, what, what, what's the term? Like, kicking someone while they're down or something, you know? And it's it's at that point to where it's just like okay can chill out a little bit but but trying to say that like it's it's caused him so much trouble like this particular video or just people talking shit in general i don't know maybe it's because i've never had like a video made on me i mean that is one of my that, that that's one of my first goals is to have someone make a video over me okay but I don't know, dude. It's It's like if I were to tweet out like, you know, like some super famous person is dumb and I just put so and so is dumb and then all of a sudden they fucking react to it and it's just like I, it's I don't know. It's it's just petty, I guess. I mean, it's obviously because of the content i do i yeah. make videos criticizing other people yeah, are you, wasn't open to also being criticized yeah, are you are you familiar with the saying violence begets violence yes i am but like when my so, community they're not my community isn't being serious they're joking and i can oh, understand okay. that it's a joke like hold on so you <laughs> so you understand ev oh so it's okay so it's all jokes okay because uh, the thing that i'm wondering here is is that when i reacted to the video and a lot of your commenters were saying that I was dismissing everything as just a joke. I don't believe I did that at all, except for the one time where I was quite oh, literally the, the, joking. The venti thing. Yeah, the venti thing, yeah. Uh, Which what was the venti thing that was a joke that I said? Because I can back up any point that uh, I said. Yeah, no, you said venti was venti didn't need artifacts. Yeah, the, how is that? Took that seriously. Yeah, who who and would you take that, that? Yeah, you said that was a joke. Yeah, who so how are these people saying that that's like a literal thing? Because sometimes jokes don't land, especially yeah. when, especially when the narrative is pushed that they're not jokes. But at the same time, like if if I make a video, if I add memes to it, if I say mm -hmm. I'm the judge of the Genshin court, if I add pieces of evidence, if mm -hmm. I give you a punishment that you have to go study quadratic graphs. Do you not see the point of absolute absurdity? So you have a that, like, oh, so, 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 okay, so it is just a joke video. So you think that my takes are good? I don't know. I don't think your takes. No. <laughs> oh my god, no. But so I, it's I'm not a joke. That, I'm trying to say that the presentation is so extreme, just to like try. If I were to because take someone's mind. like, if I was tech tone. With the audience that he has, with the fame that he has, with the money that he has, why would I ever concern myself with someone who's like this low on the YouTube totem pole talking shit? Yeah, no, no, no. Like, like Flip is definitely he's flipping around right now. Like he's a he's a fucking fish. He's a fish right now. You have to set an example. <laughs> This is what happens if you ever badmouth <laughs> bad mouth my name. Uh, like, I don't know, dude. Like, again, if... if I, I, okay, they've been talking for... It started at 117. And it's... 246. They've been talking for over an hour and a half. 
And it's, like I said, it's just getting so, like, stupid. Why? <laughs> Mom, put him in a clown circus. Have all the clowns beat her to death with toy rubber bats. What? And then being said, yeah, oh, it's just a joke. It's funny. Look at the clowns. Well, the reality is my mom's still dead. Okay. that That is not a good example. <laughs> like, you know, Do you think me insulting, like saying your Genshin takes aren't good is... Does that hurt you? That is a hot take right Do there. you think <laughs> that when my livelihood was to make money oh, off of YouTube. Oh, shut the Do you fuck think up. when I was $1.1 million in debt, do you think that when the entire Genshin community was shitting on me, do you think me saying, oh, great, another dickhead made a video on me. I can't wait to deal with the backlash. When I had no money, when I was about to lose my house, what do you think that was going to do? You can paint it any way that you want. You can say, look at how... In no way is any of this relevant. Yes. Holy shit. Bro, so I get that he's 18 now, but when at the time of making that video, he was 17. Like, what... Like, I, I don't think that he should be railed this hard for something that he said whenever he was 17. That's my thing. Like, he, he is getting railed by, like, Tectone is bending this, this dude over and railing him right now for something, for a stupid, horrible video that he made at 17. And it's like, <laughs> don't touch the oven if you aren't willing to get burned. Okay, but he Tectone is throwing him into the oven and then turning it on a, uh, uh, what, what's that setting? I think it's called like, uh, like self-clean or something. But it's basically to where the oven literally heats up to its, the, uh, to, to the highest degree of heat and like straight up dissolves any like bacteria or anything else inside. They basically say like never use it because it's going to destroy your oven. Hashtag deserved. <laughs> Again, if Tectone would have stuck to maybe like 30 minutes of this conversation just to show that Flip is a fucking idiot and that he's, again, kind of a coward, then it's like, okay, sure. Like, like that's funny. Like, I would say hashtag deserved. But to go on this long? How much of a silly billy I was being. The reality is you caused a lot of damage. I've caused a lot of damage. I'm just asking you to own that and not dismiss that as I'm just a silly willy. So I, using your point, I caused damage to you. Yep. Is there proof of that? my comment section oh is this the comment section? is this not good enough because i can you can just read the comments and people will say i will never watch tectone again but they were they already did not i like used to watch video. tectone for advice back when arcanite was relatively new not gonna lie his videos about base putting advice videos was awesome i avoided a lot of mistakes thank them but after some dramas came out i stopped watching him after that, he moved on again his videos were great but after some time, the same drama after drama the community and the other creators you know it's great when you came after me i was told that was another drama that i caused those people don't represent necessarily represent me, dude. There's there's no way you can completely deny accountability. No, 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 I'm not trying to deny accountability, but those people already didn't like you. If they already didn't like you at the time, I don't dude, think my Flip, video, Flip needs to fucking stand his ground. Like he is looking me. so much worse by, like, he's curling I, his I, tail I, again, between I'm his legs say, right now. You're, you're an entertainment creator. You're part of entertainment. Do you agree with that? Do I like to make entertainment videos? I mean, I I get why Tectone 
wants to shit on this guy. Like, I get it. I, I would I would react to a video that someone made about me and want to shit on them too. But Oh gosh, dude. I don't know. Yes. Yes, that's yes. that's your host that you're enter an entertaining content creator. I still think you're an entertaining content creator. So if all of my takes were for entertainment, why did you Setting feel the example. need to point out how they no, were wrong? No, no, no. I'm not saying your takes were entertainment. I'm saying that the what you, what you do is mostly entertainment. Right. That's so why. the so the serious things I did when you were to say these are horrible, what do you think that would do? I mean, come on, man. Because it's it's Genshin takes, dude. I just don't. The thing that I was system. using to earn an income and a living. But that was mostly like your most popular video if, on your guides are there. It's just you. See, I would also never go into a conversation like this with Tectone unless I have like all of my fucking facts straight. Like I would look at the analytics at the time of making the video and like Tectone's viewer count and just go from there and just keep research as much as I could. That way, like if because the Right now, there's no way to disprove what he's saying, right? Making this shit, Making this shit on Tech 10 video. Wait, when? Wait, did I shit on Tectone's video? And you were making one. Oh, when am I making one? Oh, okay, okay. I mean, I do Tectone reactions all the time, but, but I, I actually really like Tectone. I just think he's really dumb sometimes. <laughs> but I, I mean, I'm dumb too, so it's just like, who fucking cares? You're wailing and stuff. That's what people, people don't watch. My number one most viewed video is me fixing someone's account. An account review? Okay, sure. And so is my second one. And the third one. Then after that's the Homo one. Right. But are you are you really gonna deny it? You can't even just own up to like, hey man, I was a shit disturber. I mean, that's your whole channel, man. Not really, not anymore, not really. Okay, it doesn't matter if you killed a guy last year. You're still a murderer. Yeah, at the time, I mean, at the time, yeah. I just if I look back on my Genshin court now, I wouldn't. These are the most it. extreme Again, examples. Wait, so are you sorry that you made it? Talking shit to about Tectone is I'm sorry that I, I'm sorry that I is on par with murder. <laughs> I targeted you sometimes in that video, whereas in my God, recent one, like, like Forest or Super Tom or Tenha, I mostly attack their takes, uh -huh. and I try to make a joke out of the takes. I'm not, I, I'm not trying to make it like an attack on character, and I shifted away from that. Cool. Then I accept your apology, and that's all that matters. Yeah, I, okay, I am I am sorry for the way I came up in that Genshin court. Flip, you're such good, a brother. wuss. It's oh just my content. god. So yeah. then I guess we're chilling then, eh? Yeah, I mean, I, I've never hated you. I know, man. I've seen your Twitter messages. I, I, hold on. I, even, even after, I think even after I made the quote, I was still like replying to all of your tweets. I, I like you, dude. Hey, and that, that's all that matters. You see? Hey, easy. Bygones be bygones. Bro. Do, do you think I came here to like Shit on you? Nope. Not even 1%. Because I, cause I, cause I, the way you came up here, I was so confused because the, the DMs we had, I thought like, the DMs were nice. I, I don't know. I mean, I feel like we're we just two dudes clearing things up. Yeah, sure. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, I'll tell you what, Flip, I'm going to unban you from my Discord. <laughs> Okay, wait, can we talk about the Discord ban, actually? I would, I would actually love to. Because <laughs> I don't know, I don't know what happened. Because... It, okay, wait. it actually does sound like he was crying. And like, he's trying to like, not make it sound like he was crying. Sorry, carry on. Yeah. 
Yeah, because I don't know what happened. Because as far as I was concerned, maybe that's just his voice. Uh, I heard that you were an active member of my Discord. You were in there sure, yes. all the time. I was, yes. Yep, and then uh, I see your little messages, and I thought they were very cute. I won't. I won't show them on stream. They are okay, very cute, God. right? But no, I mean, don't get me wrong. Am I an intent? <laughs> Riku, what are you, what are you doing in Tectone's chat? Crying little bitch. <laughs> this guy. Oh yeah, absolutely. Is that uh, your alt account? But yeah, no. As far as I'm concerned, we're chilling, man. Sure. Wait, wait, can we, yeah, can we talk about the Discord man actually? Yeah, go ahead, because I, I don't know what happened, because sometimes oh, I yeah, feel wait. like maybe my mods can be a little bit too much of hard asses. I remember, I think the reason I found the video so funny is because you said I made the video on you eight months apart from the Discord man. I thought that was the funniest part, actually. Oh, yeah. Wait, when, why did you, when did you realize that you needed to make this video? And why did you get banned? Okay, because the reason I made the video, okay, because I, I did a, a poll like who do you want to see like mtas or tech zone because again my comments are like again they're viewer requests i don't actually watch that much Genshin content anymore mm -hmm. so people were commenting like every video tech zone tech zone tech zone, tech zone or mtash because they were the you guys were the two bigs at the time i was like okay i'll make a community support video you want to see uh, then you were first mtash was actually winning and then you just made like the biggest comeback ever but yeah the reason i got banned on your discord server okay the first i, got, I had three warnings the first warning was, I was actually off topic. That was me messing up, right? So, in the help channel, what were you if you about? gave bad... Hmm? What were you talking about? I think we were talking about, like, on anime in, like, the Genshin help channel. I, f I fucked up there. What, yeah, anime, so, what anime were you so excited about that you wanted to talk about it? One Piece Peak Fiction. No, it's not. What? No, it's not. It's so good. I mean... Did it's... you watch Gear 5? Yeah, no, I'm current on the mod. I mean, don't get me wrong. It depends what you mean by peak. Maybe this is another semantics thing. When I say peak <laughs> fiction, you know, I consider that it is the best. There is nothing better. I think there are many oh, okay. things better than One Piece. I think One Piece okay. is great. Yeah, right? I think there's things just, yeah. Because my, my personal favorite manga is Berserk. I own the entire thing behind me on my shelf, and I even have a... Uh, <sighs> okay, so is, is, is the conversation over now? on 45 minutes semantics was painful eggy heading okay so so that was the full conversation